I think the de defining characteristics of progressive music is first and foremost really uh, good quality musicianship. Progressive music to me it's about freedom of expression. And, and there's freedom in it because it's like one section progresses. I don't think of it so much as like uh, like rock was progressing as as a writer you progress from one section to another and then you maybe restate a theme and then you progress into it. It's more like more like the classical style of writing. The songwriting generally would tend to be uh, longer songs, long instrumental passages, lots of odd time signatures. I mean, progressive nowadays, I think for most people, means something they can relate to. Bands like Emerson, Lake and Palmer, King Crimson, Yes, etc. Frank Zappa, maybe. So anything that sounds remotely close to that type of, of, of playing, they say this is progressive music. But, uh, and then of course there are other people saying that progressive music is uh, bands like um, Radiohead or Tool or something like that. I, I think the roots of Prague were planted when the Beatles did Sgt. Pepper. Because that was the first album First of all, it was the first album that was really made as an album and not a group of songs. So it really um, established a whole new way of presenting a record. Uh, but it was also filled with such daring experimentation that went way beyond anything that was commercially ever acceptable at that stage in 1967.